the investigation would commence. If need be, if need be, the body will be exhumed. It's not too late. The body can be exhumed and not totally can be performed. So guys, a lot of people have been thinking that what exactly can the Nigerian police do regarding to Mubad case? Vivili guy, I hope you never forget that Mubad passed away on September 2nd, 2023. And a lot of Nigerians were complaining that what exactly that attached to the passing away of this young guy? Is it the Neramali gang or is there anybody who hidden somewhere that led to the passing away of this young guy? Nigeria now did deep that the nigerian police must investigate better that why quickly they went to go and bury the guy is he anybody trying to cover some evidence up the most concerned of nigerians went out there to meet the police that they must find justice for mobad well according to the police statement they said that around june mobad have wrote a petition to allah to make sure that he is being safe but eventually you know nigerian police they don't even show more concern about about the petition written by this young guy maybe because they believe that those people who wrote the petition against are more richer than him or more having influence than him or what is really happened why will a citizen wrote a petition that somebody is trying to cut his life short and the nigerian police keep that kind of petitions under the carpet it's so sad that we find ourselves in this kind of society well as the police has now confirmed to the nigerians that nigerians should rest their mind that the thing where they happen go see open they said if it is easy or not easy for them to even remove mobad where the barrier to do more investigation on waiting cause the passing away of this guy they are going to do it they said they are ready to do everything that justice is being served to this young guy well speaking with daddy phrase on his live video the pro of the nigerian police benjamin Eiden shed more light on these issues of mobad but take a look at the video okay so basically yes we're on the matter and um for people that complain most times that um why wouldn't the police um take up some matters uh, without uh, being prompted it's it's what the law dictates there are some matters that um there must be a complainant like i told you this morning case solo like um if you based on if you hear that um some cases are struck out of court um on technical grounds that so it was struck out by the magistrate or the judge it's because of foundational problems like this so there needs to be a complainant or a petition which will be the basis for investigation so i remember telling you this morning that um, family or friends should come up with a petition yeah. and that would trigger an investigation that was uh this afternoon it came to light that they had already done a petition as far back as june mm. which was submitted at first cid Alagma, and that explains why i was not aware though they were supposed to bring the petition to me because i spoke with a friend of mobile back then in june and they said they were bringing a petition and i was expecting it but later i didn't hear anything again so I just assumed that maybe they had sorted out the issue mm. and the unfortunate incident happened. So I'm just saying that, that that's how things work. But now, as it stands, first CID um, is, I, uh, in, in terms of hierarchy, is above Lagos State Police Command. But that notwithstanding, we don't want to do hierarchy here now. The first um, PRO issued a statement this evening saying that um, investigation would commence. And that is what we are going to do. Investigation would commence. If need be, if need be, the body will be exhumed. It's not too late. The body can be exhumed and autopsy can be performed. And um, the statement also states that people should bring whatever information they have to the Commissioner of Police Legal State. That's because we don't want to do hierarchy anymore. Take yeah. it to first party, bring it to Legal State Command. It doesn't matter. We are going to harmonize it within ourselves and ensure that justice is done. Yes. So, so the one that um, you can use to get the first PRO. Yes. But the, the, that will be the lead in this investigation is P R E double -A -R -E. P P P Romeo Echo Sierra yes. Sierra again Foxtrot Oscar Romeo Abuja so press for Abuja okay. did you get that that is P R E C P R E S S Sierra Sierra. Okay. P R E F O R 
A B U J A. Abuja. Okay. At police.gov.ng. At police.gov.ng. Yeah. Uh, I'll say that again. Press for Abuja at police.gov.ng. Any vital information relating to this particular um, story should be shared with press for abuja at police.gov.ng i am pinning it right now slow down your comment okay wow a lot of people have already typed it welcome back guys you see what i'm really talking about and you hear the fact and the truth from the nigeria police if you have any evidence so far that really prove to show that this guy is being maltreated or cause case that really affect his life i want you to send that kind of evidence to the email that was just called by the police let's rally around this guy if truly you love mobad and you are being pained by what really happened to him from his father to his wife and the record label that three people that attached to his person away well i heard you to send the information you have to the nigerian police i hope nigerian police will do the best this time around then so that the nigerian people can easily have trust in them well this message also goes to the nigerian police that not until when people find that you people will really show concern about the person there are a lot of people that are going through what mobad is going through but yet they don't have somebody to be by their side and the law is not even ready to help anybody it's so unfortunate so my beautiful people give your comments in the comment section below do you really believe that the nigerian police will do their job to make sure that justice is being served to this young guy or do you believe they are still going to do it the normal way they are doing their thing i want you to give your comments in the comment section below let's hear from you what your opinion is all about and don't forget to share this video to other people out there in respect of this young guy that just passed away so that every other people we know that nigerians are really concerned about him share this video give your comments in the comment section below it's your boy holla of my media tv and i'm gonna see you in another video peace out